hi today we are going to learn about the comparison of fractions so first case which we are going to handle for the comparison of fractions is fractions with equal or same denominator so when we are talking about the fractions with equal or same denominator we are actually talking about fractions like 1 by 4 3 by 4 or 2 by 4 right these are the fractions which have equal or same denominator and what do we call these kind of fractions these kind of fractions are called like fractions right fractions with equal or same denominators are called like fractions right and when we have denominator equal or same how do we compare these kind of fractions so to understand the comparison better I am going to draw one one picture for each of these fractions so for 1 by 4 I am going to draw a circle since denominator is 4 I have to divide it into 4 parts and now let me make 3 copies of this picture as we have 3 fractions right so I have prepared 3 copies and here I am going to represent 1 by 4 so to represent 1 by 4 what I have to do yes I have to shade one portion out of 4 this shaded portion represents 1 by 4 right and if we want to represent this fraction this is 3 by 4 so to represent 3 by 4 what I have to do yes I have to shade 1 2 and 3 portions in this picture the shaded portion represents 3 by 4 right and now the third fraction is 2 by 4 right so to represent 2 by 4 I have to shade the number of portions written in the numerator which is 2 so I have shaded 2 portions out of 4 and this represents 2 by 4 right yes so now tell me which of the picture has maximum portion shaded the picture which has maximum portion shaded is actually representing the biggest fraction right so this is the picture the middle one it is representing 3 by 4 it is the biggest biggest portion right and which comes after this yes the picture in which I have shaded two parts in yellow right so next comes 2 by 4 right so biggest is 3 by 4 and then comes 2 by 4 and 2 by 4 is actually representing a smaller fraction than 3 by 4 and after this in the end we will have 1 by 4 this is the smallest fraction right if we talk about the areas shaded by this fraction here we have only one here we have three portions shaded and here we have half or two portions shaded so here the biggest fraction is 3 by 4 then comes 2 by 4 and then the smallest one is 1 by 4 so this is actually the descending order of fractions right and if you see carefully here all the denominators are same and then this is actually arranged in the descending order of numerator right so to compare the fractions which has same denominator just compare their numerators and the fraction which has bigger numerator is actually the bigger fraction and the fraction which has smaller numerator is the smaller fraction right so suppose if we have one more example suppose we have to compare 3 by 6 and 5 by 6 which is bigger yes so what the logic we derived we derived when we have same number as denominator just compare the numerators 
and put this sign. So here 5 is greater than 3. So 5 by 6 will be greater than 3 by 6. Right? And to understand it better, again we will draw one picture. Divide it into 6 parts. 3 by 6 is represented by this portion. Right? And 5 by 6 is represented by 3, 4 and 5. This fraction. Right? This is 5 by 6. And this much portion is 3 by 6. Right? So here as we can see it is right in front of us. 5 by 6 looks bigger than 3 by 6. And numerator 5 is bigger than numerator 3. Denominators are same. So the fraction 5 by 6 is greater than the fraction 3 by 6. Right? So this was the comparison of fractions when the denominators are equal.